everybody welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new video so it honestly feels like ages since i've sat down and like done a proper video like this i think it was like sometime last month just feels like a really long time and a lot has happened in that time as well as you can see we have a little new addition to florally home which i'll speak more about in a minute and let me just switch hands and tell you about something else that has happened Yes, Jake proposed after nearly nine years together, which is just insane. But we got together when we were quite young, like in high school. So yeah, nearly nine years together and he proposed on my birthday gathering. So like the day before my birthday and it was honestly just so special. And I was so shocked. Like you can probably tell from my reaction on that video. I was just like, what is happening? So as you've seen from the title of this video, it's going to be a what I got for my birthday video, but a little bit different because I'm going to be showing you like the presents that I got from family members and friends of course but I'm also going to be talking about little baby Bonnie who was also a birthday present what you baby and of course I'll also be talking about the engagement and the proposal which was I'm kind of classing it as like a birthday present because it was the day before my birthday so yeah lots to talk about lots to show and yeah I'm happy to be back filming it feels like ages since I've just been sat filming a video it feels like so long so I'm happy to be back in front of the camera just chatting with you all. So I won't hold Bonnie for the whole video because she probably wants to have a little run around in her room so I'll talk about Bonnie first. So a couple of weekends ago, I think two weeks ago now, oh we've had her for two weeks, that is so cute, it's gone so quickly. Although it feels like we've had her for ages as well, it's a bit weird. But yeah, two weeks ago I was just like chilling on the couch and there was a knock at the door and Jake went and he came back in and he said it's for you and I was like what do you mean it's for me like who's knocking at the door at that time and it's for me so I went to the door my brother and my sister and my sister-in-law were there and they said happy birthday and I was like happy birthday what I was like it's a week until my birthday and there was this box on the mat and I looked inside the box and little Bonnie was in there in a little fluffy bed. I'll try and insert some videos and pictures from that day because it was just so cute and my reaction as well. I was like so shocked. I didn't expect this at all. Happy, Happy birthday! birthday. <laughs> Are you meant to be ready? Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> like a bird! <laughs> I tried to get you ready, I said we were going out for lunch. <laughs> and let me just show you the signs that came with it as well. I'll try not to drop Bonnie at the same time, but this was one of them. So it says, happy birthday from Danny, Greg, Liam, Laura, Finn, Soso, Ola and Sebi. So they're like my siblings and their partners and their children. So it's a joint birthday present from them all. And honestly, it's just the best present ever. And then this one was so cute. It says, hello, I am very small and cute and I need a mummy. Will you be my mummy? It was just adorable. And honestly, she was so tiny in that little bed. She's grown a little bit now, but she won't get much bigger than this, the, um, the breeder said. So yeah, we are just in love with little baby Bonnie. <laughs> so she's gonna live in the house. She's a house bunny I don't really want her outside or anything and it's not really safe for them outside So I've heard so she's got like free roam of all the house She can go in all the rooms, but her main room is the laundry room. We've got all like her setup in there I've ordered her like so many things. She's like a little baby like I'm just obsessed I've bought so many things for her so I'm gonna make another video like dedicated to Bonnie and show you the room and show you the setup because quite a lot of people have house bunnies and I feel like people might want to see how we set up a room and I've had loads of questions about whether they're messy and like whether they can be litter trained and stuff so I'll do a whole video dedicated to Bonnie because she just deserves it isn't she <laughs> I thought I would just give a little close-up of her as well so that you can all see Oh, she's just so cute. She like matches. We've got the same colour hair, like it's just meant to be. He's just the sweetest little baby and her little grey ears. She's very good as well. She just lets us hold her and stroke her and she really likes strokes. She comes on the couch with us at night and just like snuggles in, honestly. If you're thinking about getting a house bunny for you or like your family and you're not sure whether to, I would honestly recommend it because they're just so easy to look after. Like. They're quite independent, but also really loving and like like strokes and stuff at the same time. And they're just so, so cute. 
and yeah I would definitely recommend I'm like a crazy rabbit lady now <laughs> say bye to everyone Bonnie <laughs> okay I'm back I've just popped Bonnie back in her room honestly I'm just obsessed like I'm gonna try not to talk about Bonnie for the whole video but I'm honestly obsessed you all need to go and get a house Bunny because they're just adorable but moving on to the other exciting thing that has happened recently I just can't believe it it's just I feel like I look older like I feel like I look more grown up with this ring on my finger like I don't know is that weird <laughs> but yeah if you are followers of florally home you will have seen that last weekend i didn't post a video because i was just so busy like I, I i was actually meant to film a video on the day of the proposal like i got ready and everything and then i came downstairs to see all of all of like the pictures all over the floor and stuff so i was actually meant to film a video that day obviously that went out the window so i had no video to post last sunday so i posted a little reel of the proposal so if you have followers on florally home you will have seen that it was so perfect and out of the blue and it was just so special like such a special and cute proposal i was crying jake was crying it was just very sweet and romantic and the ring is just amazing so the ring was made bespoke by a jeweler's called brown and newworth and jake just said that they were so good to work with and like really nice and you know just made the perfect ring my sister helped jake pick the perfect ring as well like let me just give you a little close-up and it literally is the perfect ring like it's everything i wanted i wanted oval i wanted like quite a big oval a parve band and yeah he did good <laughs> and then i just love the box as well so it's just brown all on the outside but then inside it's cream with pink around the edge i mean can you get a more perfect engagement box that's just so cute isn't it so yeah i'm just i mean like a an engagement bunny bubble and yeah i'm just super happy <laughs> again like with bonnie i'm going to do separate videos for wedding and engagement stuff and i'm so excited to start like planning the wedding and i'm thinking of going like wedding dress shopping like try on and do a video all about it so yeah if you love wedding content then stay tuned for that coming soon okay so that's enough of bunny spam and engagement spam and now i'll move on to some of the other gorgeous bits that i got for my birthday so as if the engagement ring wasn't enough of a birthday present from jake he also treated me to some neptune fabric cushions from country abodes and this is the all of fabric in the color trend and how stunning are these I've been wanting some Neptune fabric cushions in this like all uh, fabric for so long I just think the flowers are just gorgeous and you know me I love anything floral obviously being florally and I think this color trellis goes with everything so nicely it goes with creams I've got my cream cushions here it goes with greys like it will go nicely in my bedroom so no doubt I'll be moving these cushions around <laughs> all the rooms in my house but yeah I'm just in love and they were really reasonably priced on country abodes as well so if you are wanting Neptune fabric cushions definitely go and check country abodes out because she does lots of different Neptune fabrics for really reasonable prices with really good feather inners as well so go and check out her business so yeah Jake got me those I've just got them here on the couch but then they also put in a gifted cushion in the Francesca fabric this little small oblong cushion which I just love so much I love the cream background I love this Francesca fabric so much and with like the little acorns on I feel like it's really suited to autumn and it's kind of in like this like burgundy dusky pink color which is a really cute autumnal color as well and it's my name as well like my real name is francesca so yeah i just love this fabric <laughs> so yeah that was so kind of them to pop an extra cushion in i just love them it's like the fabric on one side and a plain fabric on the other side which i like because you can either have a plain side one day depending on like what room you're putting it in or you can have the fabric like the pattern side on show so you get like a two-in-one basically and then you've got a little tag on here saying country abodes just a nice little neutral brown one so yeah really really love this business i also got another cushion you can never have too many cushions although i feel like i am getting to that point where i do have too many cushions and i'm running out of rooms to put them in but hey ho but this gorgeous cushion was from my two best friends as part of their like joint gift for me and it's from alter me home it's a secret garden cushion in this oblong shape and i think this is so stunning let me give you a close-up of the pattern Oh my god it's so pretty i love how neutral it is and i love how like subtle the pattern is as well like the background color it's kind of like a creamy sagey green color 
don't know if it's picking up well on camera but it's a really gorgeous colour that I am loving at the minute and then it's just got these white patterns like flowers and leaves all over the front it's just honestly stunning and I can't wait to pop this up somewhere I'm not sure where to put it maybe in my hallway or maybe in the laundry room or the bedroom literally endless possibilities but I just know that it's going to look gorgeous wherever I decide to put it as well as the secret garden cushion they also spoiled me to a white company candle so i've wanted the autumn candle for ages i've not actually had an autumn candle from white company and i would have been happy with just like the little signature one the 20 quid one but they got me the botanical one which is so exciting oh my god how pretty is that i love the botanical candles from white company i just love how like you can see all the leaves and things like through the candle Oh, it's so autumnal. I'm so ready for autumn now. So yeah, I'll probably unwrap this within the next couple of days and start lighting it because I feel like it is very much autumn now. Like the weather's starting to change and it just gets me so excited. So yeah, I am in love with this and can't wait to smell the scent of autumn. My lovely TA at school got me this Neom Reed diffuser and I've never had a Reed diffuser from Neom before. I usually just use the Neom, the wellbeing pod. So I'm excited to see like what this one smells like. It says it's the scent to calm and relax and it's got Moroccan blush rose, lime and black pepper. So let's see if I can open it. I can never open diffusers, so I might have to call Jake in to open it so we can give it a smell. Oh my god. Oh my god, the neon diffusers are so easy to open. What? You just like unscrew that and it's literally a screw top lid. Normally there's like some big cork like wedged in and you end up breaking a nail trying to open it. <gasps> that is so good. Credit to neon for making the diffusers like this. Oh, it smells so nice. It does smell like a spa. Like it smells like, you know, when you walk into like a fancy spa and they've got all the oils burning. That's what it smells like, I love that. Yeah, that was a cute gift from my lovely TA and I feel like I'm gonna pop it in the bedroom because it's quite like calming and relaxing and you know, like when you're just chilling before you go to bed, I feel like it will be the perfect scent for that time. So, and also I don't have a diffuser in the bedroom yet. So I feel like this is perfect for there. From Jake's family, I got some cute little beauty bits. So from his auntie and uncle, I got this UK Lash Serum, but you can also pop it on your brows as well. And this was recommended to me from my brow and nail tech, Kate at Kate's Beauty Space. She's also Jake's cousin and also one of my good friends. So yeah, she recommended this to me and she's got perfect brows and her lashes are so long and thick so yeah I've been using this every night on my brows and lashes you just need like one line on each brow and then one line like eyeliner on each eye and hopefully I get longer fuller and healthier eyelashes like it says on the box <laughs> and then from Jake's parents I got some Charlotte Tilbury bits my favorite they know me well so I got the Charlotte Tilbury magic away liquid concealer which is amazing like I've always used the sharp sharp Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and that is amazing and lasts literally half a year so I love that one but this one is so good as well it's nice and creamy but not too thick it's not as thick as the Tarte Shape Tape one but it's still quite good coverage so I've got it on today and I feel like my dark circles are pretty much hidden so yeah really really good concealer from Charlotte Tilbury and then this is the best lip gloss ever I don't know if I've ever spoken about this on my channel before but it's the from Charlotte Tilbury obviously it's the collagen lip bath and I get the colour refresh rose which is kind of just like a clear pinky colour and this is honestly such a good lip gloss it's glossy but not sticky and tacky it's so good Jake once had Kate for Secret Santa and obviously I just sorted the presents and I got her this from Jake and now she's converted she says it's the best lip gloss ever so if you're looking for a really good lip gloss definitely get this one. On my auntie and uncle I got some cute little hair bits, I got some shampoo and conditioner from Tony and Guy which will be good to use and I also got this pink hair turban which I'm excited to use as well. I've been wanting one of these for quite a while because sometimes I get out of the shower and I'm trying to like balance a towel on my head whilst doing my makeup and it's just like a bit annoying and the towel falls down and you know what it's like so I feel like this will be more secure and will just like keep all my hair up and like dry it at the same time so then it makes it quicker when you're using the hairdryer so I feel like this is a really handy little hair care product. I also got some little bracelets from Joma Jewelry. It's always cute to get a little Joma Jewelry bracelet. So I got one from my sister-in-law's parents that says happy birthday on which is super cute. It's got a little star on so that is dead sweet and then I got one from my mum which is to do with Bonnie and 
it says a little paw print. I think she just must have like seen it and thought it was dead cute, which it is. It's got a little like paw print charm. And underneath it says, this little paw print is the sweetest thing, a reminder of the love our pets can bring. And then I also got some other gorgeous bits from mum and dad, so I'll show you those now. So I got the new Victor and Ralph perfume in Good Fortune, and Victor and Ralph, I want to say, are my favourite perfume like brand or company. Their perfumes are just amazing. I love every one. I love Bomb Bomb in like the little pink bow. I love Flower Bomb, and this one is so nice. So I'll show you the bottle. It's so cute. I've been wearing this like all week and like all through the engagement like vibe. So I'm hoping that, you know, like when a scent reminds you of that period of time, I feel like good fortune is going to remind me of like getting engaged and getting bonny. It's just such a happy time. But yeah, here is the bottle. It kind of reminds me of like fortune teller kind of vibe. I guess it's called good fortune. Um, and it's so cute. It's got the little Victor and Ralph flower hanging off. The bottle has this gorgeous like purple lid and gold accents and it honestly smells <gasps> so good. It's very similar to the other Victor and Ralph perfumes, kind of like that same sweet strong scent which I really like but obviously it's got a little bit of a different smell with it being a different perfume but yeah it just smells unreal and it's new so I'm guessing it'll be like in all the shops so if you ever like go to Selfridges or like the perfume shop give it a smell because you will want to buy it. <laughs> also from mum and dad I got some white company bits which I am so excited about because I just love white company. But first I got the Seychelles body butter which I've wanted for so long. I got this for my TA as an end of year present for one of her presents and I wanted to keep it so badly because it just smells amazing so <gasps> I decided to pop it on my birthday list and it just smells unreal. I love the Seychelles hair and body mist and this just smells so nice. I've already used a little bit of it already, but yeah, I just I just think it's so nice to pop body cream on you, like especially when you've got like your arms out or you've got your legs out if you're wearing a dress and it just adds a little bit more fragrance to you. Like you've got your perfume on obviously, but if you pop some body lotion on as well, it's like double fragrance and you'll just smell amazing. All day and then I also put the new white company ceramic pumpkin on my list as well and I was only looking like last week like before my actual birthday and it was sold out so I was like oh I hope someone managed to get it for my birthday and of course my mum did and this is just perfect isn't it it's a really good size like I love it it's gonna look so gorgeous like anywhere I think I might pop it on my tv stand so I can look at it all the time like every night but it's such a good size and it's just perfect for neutral autumn styling which is what I like to do in my home like I don't want like orange and purple overload like obviously because that doesn't suit my home so neutral or bottom decor pieces are just the best and I just love this from the white company. Mum and dad also got me some of the Elizabeth Arden capsules and there's so many to choose from I think there's four different variations but I decided to go for the hyaluronic acid ceramide capsules hydra plumping serum and I've seen so many like vloggers and youtubers and people use these and they honestly rave about them so I decided to give it a go. I've not used any yet because I wanted to like make this video and stuff but I just love how they come in this little tub and each like dose, I know it's not like a medicine but each like usage I should say is in this like little like pod and you just like twist the pod off and like pop the serum on so I am so excited to try those. If I ever do like a like a vlog one day, like a skincare video, I will let you know how I feel about these. But yeah, I've heard really good things and I'm excited to try them. My parents also got me a new lipstick. This is my favorite MAC lipstick ever, or one of. I love Angel MAC lipstick, but this one is such a nice shade. It's a shade I've got on right now. It's kind of like a pinky, nudie color, and it's a cream sheen as well. So it's kind of like nice and glidey, like you can still like move your lips and it's not like dead drying like a matte one and this is in the shade peach blossom and it's just such a cute color i'll get it out to show you i feel like mac lipsticks just like last so long as well don't they here's the color it's just like a cute little pink color and it goes really nicely under the charlotte tilbury lip collagen the lip bath like the two just work together really nicely so yeah love that little combo I've got it on right now <laughs> and mum also picked this gorgeous scarf out for me from accessorize this feels like like a teddy bear like this is so soft and it's pink as well which is my favorite so mum said that she got it me for when I have playground duty at school which is so cute so yeah this is just I just love a scarf like I love autumn and winter so much I love wrapping up and like in a jumper and tights and boots and this is just super soft and we'll probably go with half my wardrobe if not more because 
I just tend to wear pink all the time. <laughs> so yeah, that was mostly everything that I got for my birthday. I also got some like flowers and like Prosecco and candles and things, some other friends and family members and chocolate, of course. Mum also says that she's forgotten to give me one of the presents as well. She left it on her bed like when she came around for my birthday. So I will insert that here if I have it in time for the video. Hey guys, it's Chessie from the future. I'm just on my way to work and just in my little work outfit. I've got this really cute autumnal skirt on for today. It feels like autumn today, like the, there's like frosting, a little bit of frosting on the windows and stuff. Is the camera being weird? But anyway, on the video I said that I would insert whatever the final present from mum was and it was a really, really lovely one, so I thought I'd best include it. So it's this gorgeous necklace. Let me give you a close-up. So it's this gorgeous necklace that I popped on my birthday list because it is an amazing dupe necklace. Let's get back in focus. It's an amazing dupe necklace for the Van Cleef and Arpels necklace, which are like thousands. And I've seen so many celebs wear them and these little clovers just look so cute with like the pearl in the middle. And this was from Etsy for £18. So if you're walking down the street, people might think that it's a Van Cleef and Arpels necklace, but really it was less than 20 quid and just gives off the same look. So I love this necklace and I've worn it every day since mum gave it to me. So yeah, that's the end of the video, everyone. I hope you enjoyed watching. I just love watching what people got for their birthday because I'm so nosy and I just love to see like what presents people got. So I hope you enjoyed this style of video as well, including the little announcement. <laughs> so excited. So yeah, like I said, I'll do more videos on engagement and wedding and bunny, more to come as well as some awesome videos. I promise I will get some awesome home style videos on YouTube ASAP. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching everyone. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe down below. It just really helps out my channel and I'm really co close to 3,000 subscribers now which is pretty insane for me like I just feel like that's such a big number of subscribers so thank you to everyone who has subscribed already and if you haven't then please do. <laughs> and I will see you next week with a new video. Bye!